Hey yo, what is up, Trollvians? It's a tie-in to give me a ramen noodles guy. Mmm, yum, yum, yum. Man, it looks like it's that time of the month again. Better grab the rag and start cleaning. <laughs> Anyways, it really is that time of the month again because Trolls monthly newsletter is here. Yay! Yes, you heard that right. We are getting our reading peepers on. Community letter. Crystal Chronicles and Cubes Lit Quests. Greetings, Trovians. Hi, developer. Uh, I mean, greetings, Mr. Developer. March brings a whirlwind of excitement to Trove with our latest gear update. The lucky charm of St. Cube's Lick and much more. Man, I gotta be honest with you, it really grinds my gears how instead of saying update in one word, they made it two words. It's so atrocious. And since March is bringing a whirlwind, should we take cover? Whoa. Maybe get shelter for the impending whirlwind? I don't know, it's just a thought. This month's community letter is your gateway to new adventures and a glance back at the memorable moments of February. Unfortunately, the players that are on console have not been able to quote-unquote enjoy the memorable moments of February, but that's okay, because PC always exists. All jokes aside, I speculate we will at least have the Bamboo Dragon, either this event or in a few months... Detective Italian at your service, here to sniff out trove stuff exclusively for you. Recap. Hold on. Hold on. Let me jump in my hot tub real quick. It's definitely not a time machine, I swear. In February, Trove was buzzing with excitement and companionship, I bet. Thanks to the heck bugs and love event. Well, if the bees are excited, that means we will get honey. Oh, I pray to the almighty bee we get honey. I mean, what? Sweet! Trovi and honey, my prayers are answered. OP. A heartwarming adventure where love was truly in the air. And in the caves as our little critters made a special appearance in the moon glow grotto of Geode. One second, I could see the hearts in the air. Oh, I've almost caught one. And I failed. Such a disappointment. Only thing I've ever accomplished is becoming heartbroken with the lack of content. My heart. The Bamboo Dragon festivities continue and the good news is, there's good news? That the console players won't have to wait much longer to join in. The Ravelin, the Hollow Spirit will be arriving on consoles in March. Yay! Oh goody, finally a confirmation. It's like we've been waiting a while, like we're at the DMV waiting line. <laughs> we also wanted to extend a hearty thank you to everyone who participated in our community event last month. During our Lucky Scales event, you shared your favorite fishing spots with us and we like to highlight one of your favorites. Why, you're welcome, Trove. We're all very appreciative of what you do. So we got one photo there submitted by Cool Turtle. Uh, Alright, this next part, I'm not going to read this next section exactly word for word, but I'll give you the rundown, basically. Of course, you can read it too while it's on the screen if you want. But basically, Trovasaurus is a fan site that's not affiliated with Gamago in any way. You go there to see all the Trove mods, Trove informations, contests, and stuff like that. That's where you go to see a lot of the Trove stuff. Or you can go to YouTube, but Trovasaurus is also a good source of information as well. Uh, same thing with the next one. I'm not going to exactly read all of this, but I am going to give a shout out to Wahoo Gaming. Wahoo! <laughs> shout out to Wahoo, though. He makes straightforward content about Trove. He also makes guides and stuff like that. He makes uh, content for Trove just like I do. So this just this just basically tells you how to get on the public test server if you wanted to know how. You have to have Glyph installed, which is a launcher for the PC version of Trove. And in the menu, you just got to click PTS and download it and switch to PTS. And you'll be able to test out new content when it arrives. Get ready for a stroke of luck, Trovians. Is it a good stroke or a bad stroke? So they touched our luck and we are highly overpowered now. Anyways... The St. Cubesic event is rolling in on March 12th, bringing in a wave of fortune to Neon City, Luminopolis, Desert Frontier, and Jurassic Jungle. Watch out for the tidal wave, surf's up. <laughs> Make sure you keep an eye out for Luck Beasts and Fire Beasts taking over dungeons. Spicy. 
And don't miss out on two new mounts, two allies, and much, much more. Well, I mean, finally, we all thought it was going to be this week, but I guess not. So, in that case, get ready for St. Cubes, like Trovians. Alright, so I wanted to, um, before I ended the video, I wanted to cover something that I didn't cover last video. I decided I'd cover it you anyway, so let's go into Trove here. Okay, alright, so... So this is a PTS server. When you log in, you're going to see the hub and you're going to see all this stuff. So what I wanted to show you was going to be over here. That's going to be the new content. Now when you come over here, oh, also ignore my power rank and my levels and all that stuff because, well, PTS and I don't want to start over again. <laughs> so, so if we come over here to Guillermo Armada, we press E on him, we can look at his inventory. Now, I don't have the full information on all this stuff, but I will be making a future video on this stuff and what it does and all that stuff. So you got your gear crafters vault, you got your gear crafting forge, which are decoration benches, You got and you got all your molds here, which flux sink. <laughs> so, um, in addition to this area, there's going to be the gear crafting forge. If you now you're going to have all these tabs. Just like any other profession, it's going to increase every 50 levels. So, first one is novice. Second one is advanced weapons. Shadow. Radiance. Stellar. And crystal. Now, I could be wrong, but I believe you have a chance of getting C5 from these. I'm not 100% sure. Again, I don't really have all the information on this, but I will have it all in a future video. So yeah, this is this bench. It's, it works as a profession. Um, the other bench that's going to be here is going to be the Gear Crafters Terminus. Now this is just this is going to act just like the star chart. It's going to have these four four nodes here that branch down. The first one is going to be related to Crystal Two for crafting upgrades with crystal 2 weapons and stuff like that. Second one is going to be crystal 3 and the third one is going to be crystal 4. Now this is the new area. Um this is the new area. I I was going to show you but I wasn't I wasn't sure if I was how I was going to do it exactly because I don't have uh I don't have two screens so I had to I had to use my TV for now, but when I get two screens, I'll be able to provide more PTS videos and stuff like that. But for now, this is all I can really do in regards to that. So yeah, I wanted to show you guys what that looked like. It's going to be plopped right here, right next to the Sun statue. Again, as if the hub is are as if the hub isn't already congested. Anyways, I want to thank you all for watching this video, and I. I love you so much and I hope you have an amazing day. And before I log off, ping pong, bing bong, give me a ramen noodles.